Yo, what happened to Tomoe? Is she fine? Is she, did she take her advice a little bit too serious? No one can reach her right now. Not even Fragment. I have a feeling that she's reenacting all the samurai movies that she's seen. And she's probably under like a waterfall doing like, like meditation or some shit. And when she comes back, she's going to be like an enlightened warrior. We're going into this new arc of accepting this S-ranked quest. But at the same time, the client who requested apparently is a pain in the ass. Let's begin today's reaction. Ugly. <laughs> Ugly. He's short. <laughs> Wore a mask. Ugly as fuck. Patrick. Patrick. <laughs> Patrick. Like one episode. <laughs> yeah, this guy is rich, rich. Oh my god. Why would you say this though? Like, if you're trying to, like, if you're trying to, like, look good so that this client accepts you, why would you reveal this? Not only am I the worst fucking candidate for this position, this is also my first job. Okay. <laughs> you're the perfect candidate. Damn, I really want you now. Yes, network. He's trying to leech off of you. Damn! Honestly, you might think that this is like, L, fuck this guy, but he's absolutely right. This dude is running the company here, he's doing well. Some random fucking kid shows up, no experience, no nothing. All he wants to do is fucking leech just to get networking so he can ride off our clout. In business propositions like this, there needs to be like a mutually beneficial relationship, right? He's not really wrong here. What needs to be done initially is to build the trust. Ignore the deals, ignore the sales. I learned this from my current boss, actually, who's like the master snake oil, snake oil salesman. Basically, never like approach a deal as if you're trying to sell a car, right? Because if your goal is to just to sell a car and just to scam this guy and get the fuck out of there, sure. But what you want is like, you want this like trust established. It's, you want this to be a long-term commitment where they succeed and you succeed. If they succeed again, we succeed. And in order to do that, you need to like build the foundation of trust first. So even if you have nothing to offer, you could offer knowledge. You can, you can be open-minded and try to like, I don't know, just, just learn and try to offer anything back. But if you approach this by kind of in like a way of very transactional relationship, often wise, these business relationships fail because there is no trust in the beginning. <laughs> The title is called The Melancholy of Handsome Middle-Aged Men. <laughs> what is this title? <laughs> he don't know. Hey, there it is. <laughs> and we got a lot more too. Maybe he'll completely change his mind now. Money. Special medicine to heal who your lover? Yo! This guy sounds like a good person all of a sudden. I mean, the, the way that he was kind of like um, foreshadowed in the past episode is that he might be like an evil person where everyone kind of just like disappears, whoever works with them. But it sounds like it's just hard quest and he's just trying to save his daughter and wife. Which doctor's ritual? What? Witch Doctor? Level 8 cursed? Oh my god! No way! What if we just fucking cast our barrier over them? Domain expansion. Ryuiki Tenkai. And then he goes... Cure all. And they're like, wow! We feel so much better! And it's over. Who the fuck is the Witch Doctor? Oh, he's actually dead. So he can do it. Oh, our elf friend, yeah. Oh, we have a lot of eyes, don't worry. Yeah, we have a lot more. Who are you? The melancholy of handsome middle-aged men. I think these two are it. I mean, the, 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 the master butler is a... Got kind of beyond middle, right? But okay. <laughs> what the fuck? Shout out the manga panels. He's a good person. They love him. Yeah, 
Test? Should be no problem, right? Test. What kind of test? Written test? Uh oh. Man, the adventure skill didn't give a fuck? What, what is this bullshit? No, written. Ew, ew, ew. Oh. Play the multiple choice at least. Practical is alright, we can just wing it. That should be okay, but the written is eh. No, that's super easy. Economic strength. But like, don't we, can't we just sell our fucking fruits from the demi plane with the persimmons and get so much money? Like, money is not an issue. I'm not gonna lie, the uh, the merchant uh, guild receptionist is a lot more harder than the adventurer's one. Just my opinion. Half a year cooldown if we fail. That's easy. Uh, we, we got plenty of money. Now we got our own company. Yeah? Dude, this is leftover money, bro. Straight up, this is leftover money. But we can't read it? What? What's on the test? Maybe it's too easy? Maybe it's really easy for him all of a sudden. Can I take the test now? Right now. So something about the book, it was way too fucking easy. The test, what's 2 plus 2? It can't be that simple, but okay. Somehow, I, I expected this to be kind of like tough for him for no reason, just as like a joke, but okay, it should be super easy. Yeah, right now. Is this another handsome middle-aged man? No cheating. You don't need a calculator, bro? I mean, there is no calculator here. Oh. Their standard for academics and intellect here is very low. So even such a hard entrance exam for the merchant skill is literally just like a fucking grade 4 student's test. I see. Easy. <laughs> no. Everybody's so full of themselves. They're like, <laughs> yeah, are they all idiots here? So humans are all super good looking, but also really stupid. It's interesting the way that the humans are structured here. And like the goddess just loves anything that's beautiful, right? I think that's something that's very easily looked over in the first episode, right? The first episode of any anime episode, I feel like there's a lot of shit that just throws it at you and you don't realize how important they are until later. So if we can already kind of take this, the fact that the goddess only loves beautiful things and she blessed the humans with powers because they're beautiful beings, basically only taking the vanity aspects of a human, like a human being, all, all like the, the superficial things, and good looks, but they're also fucking dumb as fuck. Interesting. I, I, they, there might be nothing deeper into this, but it's interesting to see what the goddess values in people and just beings and how that kind of reflects in their own, you know, humans here. Hello. And it's over. <laughs> no, too easy. Get the fuck out of here. <laughs> Masaka, it can't be! He looks insulted, dude. He straight up looks insulted. It's a miracle? Really low, apparently. The goddess has, like, no standards. No, this might be even easier. This might be even easier, actually. Oh, number four. Is it unlucky? So? Do we already have it? Nah, it's probably so easy for us. I wonder how they rank in terms of, like, how hard it's to get compared to the ruby eyes that we handed over in the beginning. I bet the ruby eyes are easier to get. Why are you, like, gatekeeping and try to hope that this guy fails right now? Like, shouldn't you as an instructor try to, like, inspire and motivate and hopefully they pass? What the fuck? is like, oh, you ain't gonna pass this one, motherfucker. <laughs> okay. Easy. Or just handle, hand over those again. Smart. Hold up. Yeah, I mean, if you can prove that you have harder materials, right? If you got math, that's even more difficult than get. There's no way he won't accept this, right? I don't know. I feel like if he truly wanted to be a salty piece of shit, he'd be like, uh, uh, no, it must be specifically this. Then Nakoto will take 30 minutes and come back and get, come with the materials. Yeah. Yeah. What are you going to do, old man? Around the block. Mm, that's right. 
<laughs> we have great networking. We definitely didn't get it ourselves. I mean, networking stuff like that is probably a positive point when you're trying to be a merchant, right? That's right, you got a lot of generous merch, uh, sorry, uh, adventures and a good network. First to pass with perfect scores. Woo! Hooray! Make it all caps lock. You need some emojis, bro. Show some emojis here. Is she trying to riz us? Is she trying- what the fuck? Before she was sort of like condescending, all of a sudden she's like trying to fucking riz us up. Still no CGI co What the fuck is this thing? You guys see this on the left side? W w bald? Also bald? Bald? What is this? Far left. Are you seeing what I'm seeing? I'm kinda scared. I'm kinda scared, dude. <sighs> What's Tomoe? Oh, oh, Tomoe! What kind of training is she doing? Oh, wait! Oh, dude, you know how, uh, basically back in the next time where, like, instead of bras, they'd have, like, these, like, white bands? So it's kind of cool that she has this now, right? But I thought there was nothing underneath. The clothing was always so sus and how much it could contain, but okay, okay, cool, cool. Oh my god, it's huge! Tomoe's back, okay. Yo, why is this lizardman on the right looking a little... I mean, I mean, look, look at those hips. Why are you so smooth? What, what the? What, just put a, put a wig on it and I, I, I anyways. <laughs> Holy shit. I wonder what would happen if we like brought this to the merchant's guild. What would they think? Right? What kind of tier of monster of rare materials is this compared to what they're used to seeing here? Damn, look at that sword work, dude. Damn, dude. In silence? Why? Is that a thing? I don't know. When I eat hot pot and we does like crabs in there, I don't, I don't think we eat in silence. Is that some kind of reference or meme I'm forgetting here? Is it like a one-time thing and done? You can't revisit those memories? Or is the fact that she might like break it? Emma said that? No, they're being very... It's like a library. Baited. Where is this classical music playing from? He's translating so everyone can enjoy it! Aww. You got subtitles. <laughs> Thank you. To check the memory palace. Emma is showing her true colors. Yo, she's kind of fucking she's kind of scary right now. Emma is the only person that can kind of just like control, you know, Tomoe and Mio like that too. She is. Yo, wait until she figures out Ruruni Kenshin, the anime. So, when like Mio translates it, it's obviously to our modern language, but when Tomoe watches, you know, Makoto's memories, can she even understand what's going on in those films? Is she straight up just watching anime raw without subtitles? Is that what she's doing? Hmm. Yeah, and he fell asleep right away. Maybe she'll try to like exaggerate what happened. After he went to bed before me. Yep. When's it gonna be Emma's turn, man? Moving time with sounds. Wait, Mio power up incoming from an inspiration from a memory? The menu looks pretty shitty, man. Yeah, because we slayed them. Gang crab. Is that the crab that Tomoe is already eating? 
wasn't this guy uh it was, was wasn't this guy the one that was like uh yo who took the job in the beginning right it's it's him yeah it's him it's cowpea it's cowpea it's something uh banana drink yeah, I'm, I'm not too i love bananas but i'm not really a fan of like banana flavored drinks or i don't know yeah. <laughs> Imagine this lukewarm too. Like, oh, more of the persimmons. She gonna eat them? Hey! <laughs> That's fine. I was just tasting it. Sure, sure. The king crab. <laughs> Little Tomoe is very cute. I, I, I don't really understand the point of little Tomoe though yet. Because like she just kind of exists to be this like cute token lolly that just orders people around and it's cute. But like, is she just, just a fucking NPC worker here in the demiplane? Like, 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 like what purpose does she have? Because like when it was explained that Tomoe can have fragments, implying that there can be multiple fragments. I was like, okay, where are we going with this? But she just, yeah, she's just like a manager here, man. I, I don't know. Is there anything more? Suddenly hot and cold. What's with this drastic change in weather? Did we do something? Did Tomoe do something? Did Mio do something? What the fuck is an illusory city? Illusory city? Alright, here we go. Okay. Sus. So we need a fake city. Wait, what? People are just gonna enter the demi plane and we're gonna be like, here, here's a free shit. Alright, bye. And they'll realize the value of it and then we can then sell it. Okay. Huh. I mean, this is the same shit as this, bro. Right over here. Wow, guys. Everybody, the folks over at Tokyo Tree fans give me a gift box for free. I can't believe it. It's because they're trying to advertise it. They give you free shit. And they fucking, oh, use the discount code. And they're like, wow, blah, 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 blah. Stuff like that. <laughs> stuff like that. So, I mean... I mean, this, this is how you do business, you know, this is how you do business. You give them a little free shit, which is, at the end of the day, fucking insignificant. The cost of this, it, it, it's nothing in the grand scheme of things. You're laying down the framework to, you know, fucking place a value on these items that's so unknown, and then we can sell to them for even more. So, Gregor, I'm sorry, I did that thing with the OBS where I fucking press space and restart. It's gonna be, it's gonna be two parts. All right, let's go. Nope, not listening. She's making a snowman. It's because of the weapon that she was talking about, right? Maybe this weapon has to do with the weather, too. Whoa, whoa, whoa. What's she doing? Mm. The rest of her clothes? The memories, the me memories. What memories is it? Eat the memories? What would even happen if she ate the memories? ね、何があったか説明できる。僕様ってかけた後、ミオ様は記憶のストーリー戻ってきて。え、トモエのやつ。え、そう、ベイ。あ、いや、いや、いや、いや、いや、いや、いや、いや、いや、いや、いや、い
She walking fucking Transformers? Transform? She likes children cartoons. All right. We got a fucking historical drama lover, and we have a fucking Power Ranger lover here. All right, that's nice. He is pretty mean on Tongwe. Straight up. Yeah, he's a good boss, apparently. He has a good person. Ask him. I'm sure he would, because we're so valuable now. Oh. So what, we're gonna make fucking Tomoe and Mio sleep in one bed and Makoto on the other? Come on! Oh. Oh, 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 this is definitely the thumbnail. I forgot that you were built like this, Tomoe. Okay, okay. But is Emma still the best girl after this too? I mean, we haven't really seen Emma's curves, right? Like, could you imagine some Emma fan service? Like, how do they even do that? Because, like, the pig anatomy, like, she, I, I just... I just don't really see Emma fan service incoming, you know? <laughs> Good Jesus. Oh! Ah, if you compare the two, right? I think Tomoe kind of wins too easily, right? Like, Mio... I, I think Tomoe wins. <laughs> <laughs> Bro's literally just gonna sit on the fucking chair and sleep. Hmm? Oh, it's our text message system. The elf guy. What you want? Alright, the cure all potion. Little cute, right? Just, <laughs> yo. So, like, let's think about how Mio is gonna use her new, um, Power Ranger fantasy to her, uh, powers. Transform. So, you know, Power Rangers and other shit, when you transform, you gather, like, little bits of pieces and you grow into a big robot, right? So, like, what? Is Mio gonna, like, summon her fucking minion spiders? Then they're gonna all, like, fuse together to become, like, a big spider? Like, wh what's going on here? Maybe it'll be, like, an actual fucking transform, like, a robot, dude. Like, an actual fucking robot spider. I don't know. Because she keeps saying transform. There's definitely gonna be some kind of transform moment, dude, right? Is that it? No, not yet. Why does this voice actor sound so familiar? He sounds like a mob character in... Is this EK? The classroom really? Can anyone check? Doesn't this kind of sound like EK? Right? Yo, it's those people again. They're eyeing us. I did not expect that voice to come out of him. I thought it was a girl. Why? What are you trying to do? Are you going to attack us? Oh, next episode, dude. They're going to get all the adventures. Oh my god, yo, maybe Mew can have a chance to transform. And that's the episode, yeah? Yes, sir, that is the episode. The ending playing too soon gives it a little bit away, but is this a post credit scene? No, I don't think so. Wondrous Medicine Production is next episode. This episode, again, was a bit of just setup. We're building towards something. What's it gonna be? I, I mean, I guess it is just this, like, fight, right? Where we're gonna be fighting these dudes and the adventures they bring. I hope Mio actually shows up and you get to do Transform. But, like, we can't just level this entire town, too. You know, we, 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 we can't. We need to have some kind of, like, good relations, but... If we're truly going to go down the path of, like, the Demon Lord path, the bad route where we just destroy every place, I don't know, it could be, I guess, fun, but we're still trying to, like, become a merchant, right? So, interesting that they keep focusing on becoming a merchant. They even gave us an example of how giving out free goodies will then kind of translate to them setting a price, and they realize how valuable it is, then we can sell even more, right? Stuff like that, that's very detailed. The world building is pretty good, but still, I feel like this anime still hasn't really hooked me yet, you know? Because so far... These are all just, we're just building. And we're just building. And I don't know the payoff, right? You guys keep saying Skimichi Moon Fantasy is amazing. And so far, it's been very entertaining. But there hasn't been like a defining moment where like, I'm all in. Other than when the opening starts playing. But again, we're only halfway in. We got more half. We got six more episodes left. And season two. That shit gonna be too coarse. So I'm sure this is just the fucking tutorial stage. This is just the early game, the beginning stuff. Again, like take... Tensura, for example, right? Reincarnate the slime. Shit takes fucking forever to build up, yet it's so good later, right? So I'm sure it's gonna be the same. But hey, if you're still here, 
If you enjoyed this reaction, please like the video. Check out the other playlists for more content. And until next time, take care.